Are you tired of your Windows PC slowing you down, the endless updates getting in the way, or even the looming Windows 10 end of life around the corner? Well, today we're diving into Zorin OS, a Linux-based operating system designed to look and feel like Windows. It can run Windows applications with speed, security, and flexibility all built in. In this video, we'll walk through how to install it, explore its features, and see why it just might be the perfect alternative to Windows for your PC. So let's get to it. Zorin OS is a Linux distribution built for people switching from Windows or Mac OS. It's clean, user-friendly, and lightweight, making it ideal for breathing new life into older computers. With a familiar user desktop and interface, you get the power of Linux without a steep learning curve. Best of all, the Zorin OS core version is fast, secure, and free for personal use. Before we install, here's a brief overview of what you'll need. Firstly, you'll need your target PC or laptop you wish to install Zorin OS on. Zorin OS will also run on rather older PCs, so there's a good chance you or a friend has an older PC collecting dust somewhere to use. Next, you'll need a spare USB flash drive with at least 8 gigabytes of available storage. We'll use this to create our Zorin OS bootable installer. Then, we'll need the Zorin OS ISO file. We'll show you where to grab this ISO file during the video, and we'll toss a quick download link in the video description as well. Lastly, you'll want a flashing tool like Bellina Etcher or Rufus to create your bootable USB installer for Zorin. Again, we'll have download links below if needed. All right, let's visit the Zorin OS website and download the edition you want. Zorin OS Core is free and perfect for most users. We'll use the Core OS in this video. The Pro OS version is a paid version, but it does include some nice additional features and desktop themes or layouts. Once at the site, we'll click Download, scroll down to locate the Core OS version, and click Download. This download may take a few minutes or more, depending on your internet speed. Now that the OS downloaded, let's go grab the flashing tool we'll use to build our Zorin USB installer. We'll use Rufus in this example. Visit the Rufus website, scroll down, and locate the latest Rufus release and download it. After Rufus downloads, go ahead and open Rufus. Now, insert your USB drive. Select the Zorin OS ISO file we downloaded and click Start. Once complete, you'll have a bootable Zorin OS USB drive. Now, let's walk through the install process for Zorin OS using the USB installer we just created. Insert your bootable USB into your target PC and fire it up. At startup, you'll want to access the boot selection menu. This can usually be done by pressing F10, F12, or the delete key on your keyboard. Depending on your computer, this boot menu key may be different, but a quick internet search should help you find it. Once you're at your boot menu selection screen, select the USB drive we created to boot into the Zorn OS installer. After it's loaded, you'll see the option to try Zorn OS Live or install it. You're welcome to select the Try option and poke around within the new OS, but for this video, we'll choose Install. Select your keyboard layout and click Continue. Here you select to download any updates for the installer or drivers and click Continue. Here you'll choose your installation type. You can install Zorin in a dual boot setup with Windows, you can install Zorin fresh, or you can tweak your drive partitions. We'll erase our disk and install fresh for this video. Confirm your disk changes and click Continue.
Select your time zone and click Continue. Here you'll set up a username and password, then click Continue. The Zorin install will differ from PC to PC, but our install was only about five minutes to complete. Click Restart. Remove your USB drive and hit Enter on your keyboard. Once inside, you'll notice how familiar it feels. The Start menu, the Taskbar, and the System Tray look very similar to Windows making it easy to adjust to Zorin OS. Here's some of the other things that make it feel like home. Just like Microsoft's software store. Zorin OS has a software store where you can install apps like Chrome, Firefox, and even Linux exclusive tools. The Zorin OS appearance is customizable. You can tweak your desktop to mimic Windows, Mac OS, or even touch optimized layouts. There's plenty of settings to mess around with. You'll probably notice a performance boost just poking around the OS as well. Even older PCs run faster within Zorin OS. With fewer background processes running compared to Windows, Zorin OS feels smooth and speedy. This next item is probably my favorite Zorin OS feature. There's Windows software compatibility, so you can run many Windows apps using tools like Wine or Zorin's built-in software install support. Let's take a look at how we can install a few popular Windows apps through the Zorin Software Store. I'll go grab a quick Windows app here to test with. Keep in mind here that Zorin may not run every Windows app available, but it tends to work well with popular Windows apps that do not have a Linux install version. Walk through the install process as you normally would. As you can see, it easily installed this Windows app. Now, if you have this X over your app, right click and select Allow Launching to fix that. Again, if you're tired of Windows computer slowdowns, forced updates, or you just want a fresh alternative to Windows 11, Zorin OS is worth trying. It's simple to install, easy to use, and a great way to unlock new life in your PC. Download it, give it a try, and see why so many users are making the switch. Honestly, I was really surprised at how nicely designed Zorin OS is. Well, that's it for today's video covering Zorin OS. I hope you enjoyed it and that you'll give it a try on that old PC you have laying around. If so, let me know in the comments how it turned out. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye, everybody.